All right, guys, Mike, Lone Cedar Outdoors. We're coming to you through uh, part two of a multiple part series of our segment on fire. We're setting up another little log cabin here, breaking all up so we can see. I know on part one of our video, see what I'm doing? I'm fluffing it up, getting it ready. So on part one, we showed you how to make fire with a ferro rod. On this video, we're gonna be using a fire piston. So stick around, I'm just prepping this up. And we're gonna use a char cloth and a fire piston on this next one. What we're doing is I'm getting some shavings of the fat wood. I'm gonna put it on here as an all natural accelerant. So we're getting prepped. Then I'm gonna make a bird's nest for our char cloth. Hey guys, so we got this here today. Told you we're gonna be using the fire piston today. So it's a simple mechanic, deals with combustion. So what we're gonna do, you take a little chunk of this char cloth, we're gonna stuff it in here. So you don't wanna to put too much in, just enough to catch an ember. And we're gonna get the rest, we're gonna stuff it into our little bird's nest here. So it's always easier when you're using a fire piston put a little piece in and you put the rest of it into your bird nest to catch the flame. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to do a quick demonstration first of all before we start the fire. Show you how it works. So what we're going to do here is an o-ring on here. Put a little bit of lube. I'm going to use saliva. People use Vaseline or whatnot. So my kiddos are here with me also in case you hear them in the background. It's not big, Bigfoot or nothing, so don't get excited, you know, it's just my kids. And yeah, we're going to put it here, and the way you do it is you slam it shut as fast as you can. You can see the amber there. See that, everybody? Alright, everyone, we're ready to go live now. We're going to try it. Showed you a quick example how to get it going. So I got it all in here. Okay, we got the... Amber. Got it in our bundle. folks we're gonna go ahead and top this in Anyhow, folks, this was Mike with Lone Cedar Outdoors coming to you again with part two of our series of fires. That is the fire piston that we used today to get this going. This is Mike, Lone Cedar Outdoors. Take care, everyone. If you enjoyed this video, don't forget to like, subscribe, comment, and share. Thanks for all the support.